What's up, y'all? Let's just start the video out like this. Car broke down, but you see there's still a smile on my face. You know why there's a smile on my face? Because I know I'm a spiritual being having a human experience. And this ain't gonna last long. This too shall pass. <laughs> but, uh, got a nice video coming for y'all today. I love all of y'all. Thank you for watching my videos and supporting what I do. You know, I do be going through a lot. That's why I started recording this shit, because, yo, I swear, bro, I go through so much, bro. Like, if I was, if I was really recording everything, y'all would be like, yo, this is like a movie. So, I just start recording everything. Y'all see? Stuck outside waiting for my man to come get me. I don't even know how I'm going to get this car. I'm probably just about to be like, look, I'm probably about to be carless, y'all. But, like I said, spiritual being having a human experience. Every moment is a new moment. We exist in eternal, what is it? Eternal nothingness, basically. Imagine, it's just, you know, there's just, there's just a lot going on. I'm going, I'm going to talk to y'all. But I love y'all. Tune in. Nice video coming in. Nice vlog. Like I said, y'all can tell when it's vlog style because I'm holding the, the thing instead of it being up there like that. But I'll see y'all. I love y'all. Well, I don't know why I went like this. I'm going to be right back, but we're about to start the video. Let's go. Hello, y'all. Today, we're going to be talking about the three ways to let go. Let's get into this video today. And obviously, this is a vlog. Yes, sir. What's up, y'all? The first way to let go is to create something. And I know y'all are like, oh, how is that going to get rid of what's going on right now? Well, when you create something, when you're creating something new, you're letting whatever is in your mind out to create something new. You know what I mean? It's basically like it's not distracting yourself because you're not thinking about it. You know what I mean? It it may exist, but just let it go. Realize that you can't change it. If it is a if it is a circumstance you can't change, then you can't change it. You have to accept the reality, you have to accept what is and create something. What's create something new to get your mind off of the old. And if you keep doing that over and over, then eventually the problem is not even going to bother you because you're going to be so busy creating because you love creating. <laughs> I mean, you you should love creating. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. But you make room for the new by shedding the old out, if you know what I mean, by every day you're shedding, like, shed. imagine the day's being like a, a potato, right? But every day, instead of just holding the potato, you're doing something new. So you're gonna shed some of the potato off until the potato is gone. You know what I mean? So it may not, it may not all shed at one time. You know what I mean? Like the whole problem might not go away immediately, but as you're shedding that thought out of your mind while you're creating so much, like say you're creating art or you're creating what you like to do, you solve, you're gonna get to a point where you're creating so much, you're gonna have like 70 paintings, you know what I mean? You can start doing something with that, you know what I mean? It's, you know what I mean? You have to create. You have to bring the darkness to the light, you know what I mean? By creating, you know what I mean? You just let go of the, the light that's already here with you, that's already on your consciousness by bringing the darkness in your mind to the light. The dark, the darkness as in the creativity that lies within you. You know what I mean? The, your ego. What is your ego like doing? I like making videos, so I make videos. This is me creating, you know what I mean? What do you like? What gets you off? You know, maybe I shouldn't say that on YouTube. <laughs> Let's go on to number two. <laughs> What's 
up, y'all? This is number two. Number two is meditation. Meditation brings you to the moment and it makes you feel more powerful. I know you hear meditation, meditation all over the internet already, meditation, but that's, yeah. Meditation brings you to this moment that you're in right now. 2020, that's where you're at. This is where your energy is at right now. So you can literally create. You, your soul is so big. Like it's like, imagine your soul being where you were from birth to everywhere you're gonna travel and everything you're gonna do before you die. That's how expansive your soul is. You are energy traveling through time. So when you come, when you become one with yourself and take that time out a day for yourself, and I know my hair looks a little crazy, and actually just <laughs> sit down and decide to, actually, you don't even have to sit down, you can lay down, you can, there's different ways to meditate. I'm not going to tell y'all how to meditate. I'm pretty sure you guys know how to meditate. <laughs> and if y'all don't know how to meditate, then I'll make a video on that later. Just let me know. But y'all know how to meditate, especially with everything that's going on in the world right now. They're talking about this. And it's not even, It's I guess it's a hot topic. But for real, meditation, it brings you to the moment and it makes you feel more powerful because... Once you become to the moment and you clear your thoughts, you realize you're on the same playing field as everybody else. Once you clear your thoughts and you stop running on this track and this treadmill, you turn the treadmill off and you realize, oh shit, there's a whole we're all out here. <laughs> like you know what I mean? There's not he's not better than me. I'm not worse off than him. You gotta it's that some a lot of people can't express gratitude for every single day that they're here so that's why they keep struggling because they're not grateful for what they already have so they're not trying to create something new with what they have they're just in survival mode you know what i mean so try not to be in survival mode <laughs> and i got a call but and it clears you of all negative and positive energy so instead of like thinking of things positive and thinking of things negative thinking of where you want to go and thinking about the people telling you that you can't go there. You're just here in the limbo. You hear that? It's nothing. It's just you and me and the, the empty space and time between us. You know what I mean? We're all here. We're all in the same reality. So if you think that somebody's better than you, stop thinking that because we're literally all one. <laughs> okay stop 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 thinking that somebody is just this great celebrity freaking you know what i mean there's no celebrities there's there's no famous people i mean i guess they're famous their ego is famous but when you bring us <laughs> when you bring us back down to reality we're all human beings having the same human experience so it's all what his e what their ego did made them famous. What their ego did made them who the, the person that you see them are. They are the person that you see that they are today. There's no special thing. He's better than me. I can't be like that. He's got bing. He's got a million subscribers. He's so cool. No, bro. That's not how it works. <laughs> so. Once you start to realize that, you start to realize that these days are very important. These days that are passing you by every single day that you're letting pass by, like, you know what I mean? These days that you're letting pass by, like, they don't matter. They do matter because every single day is a page in your book, a page in your personal book. But it's also connected to the spiritual book of life my nigga i don't know i don't really know how shit works i'm not telling you something you know what I mean? i'm not sitting here telling you like i i know from i just know i'm just saying when you look at it like like this you see how i am i'm 20 years old right now and i'm making a video for you like you know what i mean that's what i'm doing for this day you you get it like there's no oh yeah 
I post this video and get a million views. I really don't care. Like, you know what I mean? I'm posting this because this is a day that I'm alive and I like posting videos. This is the ego. This is my ego. You know what I mean? You don't do this. You mean, I'm saying you don't do this. You can, you can pick up a camera and start recording yourself. Like, you know what I mean? I'm just like you. You know what I mean? So it's like, let's just get into the third one. Meditation. I'll talk more about that later, but just realize we're all on the same we're all on the same playing field so don't feel discouraged if you're not where you see somebody else is in their in their book and their and their story that they're telling themselves you know what i mean everything is a story that you're telling yourself think uh, i'm burping him imagine all right i said i'm going to go to the third one we'll talk about this in another video if y'all want more information on that then Actually, I shouldn't even have to make another video. Just go check my other videos out. I've got a lot of stuff on spiritual awakening and stuff like that. You know, I'm trying to make my uh, my content more user-friendly. I'm not trying to just sit here and talk about spiritual awakening all day because obviously that's what's going on. But if you really want more content, if you want more information on that, I can make another video. But at the same time, you guys can go. You know, help me out and check out the other videos. <laughs> but we're going to get to number three. <sighs> number three. Which is, be the future you now. You have no obligation. You have no in writing contract that I have to be the person that I was being yesterday for eternity. No, bro. You can be whoever you want to be every single day you wake up. Every day you wake up, you're recreating a new persona. So it's your choice, whether it's unconscious or not, to keep either telling yourself the same story that you were telling yourself yesterday. And then it just you're just carrying that baggage of every day. Oh, yeah, this is who I am. This is what I was doing. Or you can put down all that baggage and be like, yeah, this is who I am now. You know what I mean? This is who I am right now in this present moment of being. Who are you being in this present moment? If you can really understand what I'm saying, I really hope you understand what I'm saying because that is the reason I'm making this video. It's not for just shits and giggles. I'm making this video so you can understand what I'm saying. I'm saying it as in like, we're all each other in a different space and time. I keep saying it like this because it's hard. It's easier to understand like this. We're all each other in a different space and time, but we're all here now. So the eternal now is when you get to choose who you become or who you are or who this this person that you say you are is. Who are you? Who are you being every single day? Are you just being a person that are you in an unhappy relationship and you keep telling yourself the story that oh this is who i am i'm supposed to be in this relationship i don't deserve anything better or are you just or are you choosing to take control of the now and be like oh my gosh what am i doing i've been recreating the same day for how long i don't know but i was doing the same thing i'm not speaking down on you i'm speaking to you so it's like You've been recreating the same day over and over again, but now you're becoming conscious and aware to the fact of this is me. I can do what I want, bro. Like, I'm out here, feet planted in the ground. I can become, manifest, whatever. This is why you're here. You're not here to just sit in the house all day and be like, oh my God, I'm scared. I don't want to go outside. I need a vaccination to stay alive to keep being scared and not wanting to go outside. So you're in survival mode, but you're scared to go out there and survive. I mean, I don't know. This is just how I'm viewing it as a, who is this pulling up to my house? This is just how I'm viewing it as a 20 year old man having this human experience with everybody else. So it's like they're, offer, they're offering you the saving grace to life. But at the same time, you're not even getting to enjoy life. You're just in the house waiting for the saving grace of life. You know what? I'm not 
saying nothing. I'm not going to bring up what's going on in the world because I don't want my video to take down. This is invaluable information that maybe somebody needs right now. So, it's just, it's a lot going on, man. There's a lot going on in the world. There's a lot going on within me. There's a lot going on maybe within you, which is why you're watching this video. And I don't want to take up all your time, you know? My bad. Somebody called again. But I'm about to wrap this video up. All I want you to take out of this video, the main premise of this video, the main purpose of this video is for you to understand that everything out there is a reflection of everything in here. But you have to live, learn, and actually become, what is the word? What am I looking for? I'm looking for become one with the moment and your emotions and your feelings and how you're actually feeling in the moment. If you're feeling sad, get out of there. <laughs> it's like, no, nah, but I mean, I'm serious, but get out. I want you to know, I love all of y'all for like commenting and subscribing to my music. I said my music, my my videos, listening to my music, giving me support, the, the little thumbs up and the sending the positive energy my way i really appreciate it even though you guys don't see me appreciating it this is my way to show you guys that i really appreciate everything so make sure you like comment and subscribe and i promise i got a lot of videos coming for y'all i'm just going through a lot so i'm i'm pretty sure you guys can see that i'm going through a lot i mean i'm not really I'm not going to say I'm struggling, you know what I mean? I am, but I'm not, you know what I mean? I, I look at other people's situations and I see them as, like, that's a reflection to me of, of a situation that I can be in. That's why I'm grateful every day for, the, I, for waking up in the situation that I'm in. So, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back. I love y'all. For real. Like, comment, subscribe. Really helps. <laughs>